First of all, yes, I am ripping on a racing game here. And I know what you're thinking. Easy way out. But before you get too objective, let me just say that when I thought of reviewing a bad game, this is the first game that came to mind. Why? Oh, the reasons are plentiful. To be fair, though, from the outset, the game looks decent. It's not F1 or NASCAR, and the thought of ripping around on crotch rockets seems pretty good. But then he fired up and realized this game is awful. Is it because of the handling? No, actually, the handling's pretty decent. The sound is okay, so that's not enough to deem it horrible. What makes this game so bad is that it's the most vanilla racing game I've ever played. F-Zero got it right. Racing games aren't overly exciting, so what they did was give it a futuristic setting, put in some eye-popping color, good tunes, and let her fly. Suzuka 8 Hours is so boring. The tracks? Awful. Yeah, there's some different designs, but nothing special. The bike selection? Well, there's a variety of colors. Oh, and you can decide to have better handling or better acceleration or even a higher top speed, but that's typical for a racing game. Game selection? Meh. Nothing to write home about. But do you want to know the worst thing about the game? The worst thing about this game? The game's title isn't just a suggestion. There's actually an option to race for eight hours. Eight freaking hours. Who in their right mind would actually sit down and play a racing game for eight hours? Now think of your favorite game of all time. Maybe at one point you might have sat down for a Super Mario Kart marathon, or if you were playing a classic role-playing game like Final Fantasy III on the Super Nintendo, you may have sat in and put in a full eight hours. But let's be serious. Eight hours of continual racing? Not only is that the worst option to put in a racing game, but what developer thought that this was the one item of authenticity that should have been put into a game? Look at that. Look at that! Hey, I know we're talking early 90s and 16-bit graphics and gameplays, but an option to race for eight hours? Why I ever thought playing this game as a kid would be a good decision, I don't know. This is, by far, the most boring game I've ever played, and it's shit in every sense of the word. Don't believe me? <laughs> Try racing for eight hours without tossing red shells, shooting lasers, or vehicle upgrades. I did once, and I will never forgive myself for it.